Hey guys, Alex here, welcome back to another video, hope you guys are feeling well and in this video I'm going to show you my top uh, tweaks which I'm using on my iPhone 10. So this is my primary device, I've got my SIM cards in it, so I'm using this one on a daily basis and of course the tweaks which I absolutely love. So these are the first essential tweaks for me which I've actually installed with this uncovered jailbreak right after jailbreaking my device and these are the tweaks which I would actually recommend to a friend or anybody that I know uh, to install it on their own device as well. So guys, before we start, of course, make sure you hit the like button if you will enjoy the video and possibly share it. Uh, so that would be super much appreciated like always. And as always, guys, now let's go ahead and begin. And the first tweak is called the bar emoji. So basically, you've got this little emojis on the bottom of your keyboard. These are the recent ones. So for example, when I want to send it to my friends or any other person, I don't need to actually switch the keyboards to do that. This is really convenient. I just basically press on them and they appear in this little text field. And and I can just basically send it. So this is really nice. And this one is extremely useful for all of the iPhone 10, 10R and 10S uh, users because uh, the battery percent X tweak allows you to have this battery percentage in the uh, top right corner and have it uh, always up there. So you know exactly how much of a battery use you've got left for you. And also it has a little bit of uh, quick shortcuts. You can basically double tap to enable the low power mode or double tap again to bring it back. And I don't know about you guys, but I'm super tired swiping up every single time I want to unlock my phone. So with the tweak called Fast Unlock 10, you don't need to do that. Basically, you just lock your device, tap, just look at your device, and this will unlock it for you. You don't need to swipe and make this kind of gesture just to unlock your phone. This is super neat, super nice. Once again, do like that and as you can see that's unlocks. And one more thing that I'm super tired of is the volume HUD. This has to be gone right now from the iOS because that's super annoying and has been here since the first iPhone. So uh, another tweak called Melier actually removes it and replaces this with the new kind of uh, the volume HUD. But that looks absolutely different. Take a look at that. So now as you can see that's a super clean look, kind of like we have on the iPhone 10 in the video app, but this is a really, really nice tweak. And Apple, please, just please add it to the iOS 13. I'm waiting for this so much. If you guys do too, of course, we have another tweak for you. So this is the Noctis 12 and it allows you to get this dark mode right now. As you can see on my home screen up here, we've got the dark that is now in kind of this uh, little dark tint as well as the lock screen, but we have also the settings, so you can choose uh, the apps that you'd like to uh, have this uh, dark mode on. And also, you know, it's everywhere, even in the widgets panel. So we've got this little widgets in this, of course, uh, dark tints, which is, of course, really nice. And we can now get this uh, full system dark mode right now on this uncovered jailbreak. And tap time is a very small, but uh, yet again, a very convenient tweak. So once you tap the time, uh, this will, of course, give you the uh, current day for today. So this is a really, really nice tweak and it gets really useful sometimes in the let's game mode in some of the apps. You don't need to go back to your home screen just to see the dates. And I'm personally a huge fan of the new Apple devices features. Unfortunately, we cannot get some of the features from an iPad to the iPhone and vice versa. But the new iPad Pro feature, which is uh, kind of like this connection of the iPad Apple Pencil animation is now available to the iPhone. But of course, you do not get the actual Apple Apple Pencil, but you can get it when charging. So for example, when I want to charge my iPhone like that, as you can see, there is a little animation of this Apple Pencil connection to the iPad Pro, which is a really, really nice tweak. And this one is called the Pencil Charging Indicator. And I'm sure you guys will ask me after the video, what kind of a tweak we have now on here on the bottom of your iPhone? Well, this is the 5 Icon Dock XI, which allows me to get one extra item up here in the dock. So I can get Syria, for example, in the middle and access it every single time I want. And last but not least is Animations Be Fast. This is a new tweak, but this will allow you to actually speed up the animations of the iOS. And actually, I recommend installing this one for every single iDevice because these animations on the iOS 12, they actually got a little bit better, a little bit quicker, but not as quick as we can get it. So as you can see right here, when we swipe like that, the animations are actually faster. So you can configure them in the settings of your iPhone as settings 
app. Yeah, and yeah guys, I mean that should be pretty much it for today. Here are all of the tweaks which I actually got installed by today. Of course, I'm gonna install some more in the future, so I'll probably make a part two of this video. And of course, if I will, I'm gonna have the link down below in the description or in the comments below. And anyways, guys, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you hit the like button. That would be super much appreciated. Possibly share this video with the friends, family. Uh, that will bring me a huge support. And guys, as always, I really hope to see you around on my next one. And peace out.